Hello, everyone. I'm here to give you the details of the new maths textbook, which has been released for the year 2023-24. Uh, there was a lot of confusion in whether the NEP uh, curriculum, as per the NEP, the curriculum is changing or not. CBSE has put that to rest, stating that the syllabus with a few changes for 2023-24 will be continuing. So I have a copy of the textbook that has been released and this is the cover page which is the same as before and if you see this has been released uh, in the month of October uh, 2022 for the year 23-24 right so this is the cover page and this is the uh, in uh, the reprint and here we have this revised edition October 2022, right? So this is the latest uh, uh, book that will be released and uh, all of you will be getting this in the month of March. So just in advance, uh, if I have gone through the contents and I have found that the syllabus has been deleted radically, drastically, there is very less for the students to learn and very less for the teachers to teach. So if you compare the syllabus that we had uh, prior to the COVID and now, if you look at that, a lot of things have been deleted. In fact, you will find that at least 30 to 40 percent was deleted. So in this video, I'm explaining about class nine first. So if you look at the uh, index here, the number system, we have introduction, irrational numbers, real numbers and decimal operations on real numbers, laws of exponents. So most of the things they have added here in terms of chapter one. Uh, the only thing that they have deleted is the successive magnification on the number line. The process of successive magnification, that exercise has been deleted in number system. So that need not be done anymore. If you move further to this chapter two, uh, polynomials, uh, the, the zeros of polynomial are there. Polynomials in one variable is there, factorization is there, algebraic identity. So what is missing from here is actually the remainder theorem. The remainder theorem is totally deleted. So the exercise based on that obviously will not be there in the new textbook. If you look at the coordinate system, uh, very surprisingly, the Cartesian system and introduction is there. But what has been deleted is the plotting of points, which actually is important. And it's very crucial that students learn how to plot points, but that is not there as per the new uh, syllabus or the new book. If you see linear equation in two variables, we have linear equation and solution of linear equation. Again, a very important aspect has been deleted from this. That is graph of linear equation in two variables has been totally deleted. No graphs at all. And there is um, there was an exercise based on lines parallel to the x-axis and y-axis, equations of lines parallel to x-axis, y-axis, that has also been deleted. So quite a lot of deletion in uh, coordinate geometry as well as linear equations. In terms of Euclid geometry, it was already a small chapter. It still remains small, uh, except for the fact that there was one little um, small portion about the Euclid's fifth postulate, equivalent version of the Euclid's fifth postulate that is missing here. So that is not there, equivalent version of the fifth postulate. Rest, more or less, this chapter remains same. Coming to chapter six, that is lines and angles. Uh, what is missing here from the index, it's very clear that the angle sum property is deleted. And questions obviously based on angle sum property will also not be found in the exercises. If we go to chapter seven, uh, we find that inequalities has been reduced. It's not there in the new syllabus. Inequalities is not there at all. So the other criteria for congruency is there. Quadrilateral, a lot is uh, deleted. Only properties of parallelogram they have specified. Whereas in the previous syllabus, we had types of quadrilaterals. We used to teach them about rhombus, square, parallelogram, kite, uh, trapezium, all the quadrilaterals we used to teach. At the moment, they are specifying only properties of a parallelogram. Only one quadrilateral is being discussed. And of course, the midpoint theorem that stays. So in circles, the introduction part surprisingly is missing. We used to teach them what is segment and sector, uh, you know, the uh, the minor R, major R, all that has been deleted. They are starting right away from the theorems. 
and from the theorems and then the cyclic quadrilateral part. So the introduction part I feel is missing here. And uh, in Heron formula, of course, only half the chapter is there. That is area of triangle by Heron's formula. Uh, the quadrilateral part has been totally deleted off. And surface area volume, again, drastic reduction. You find that cube, cuboid, nothing is there in terms of cube and cuboid as or cylinder. The cube, cuboid and cylinder, actually, they have discussed in it. So that they are not adding. The previous uh, book had about eight exercises where cube, cuboid and cylinders were also there. So that part is totally gone. So only we are having cone, sphere, cone, sphere here, uh, the area of cone, surface area of sphere, volume of cone and volume of sphere. So again, it's a very, very simplified syllabus in terms of surface area volume also. Statistics, again, graphical representation of data is the only thing that has to be discussed. That means measures of central tendency, mean, median mode is out. Uh, construction of frequency distribution table, which we used to do, that was out. We were discussing the types of data, primary, secondary, how to collect data and so on. That is totally out. The introduction, the collection, the presentation of data, all that is only graphical representation. So only discussion of histogram. Uh, bar graph and frequency polygon. So overall, I feel the syllabus has been reduced to such an extent that it is very, very simple. And I'm sure the uh, te teachers can try out various other methodologies in the class uh, to uh, make this course better and interesting in whatever uh, syllabus that has been provided by CBSE for this year, 2023-24. Of course, from 2024, a different set of syllabus may come. But as of now, this is the information that has come. And this is the book that has been uh, released by CBSE with the reduced syllabus. And it will be effective for this academic session from April 2023 onwards. And the exams to be held in 2024. Thank you. Thank you so much.